Well, Steve, most people do this all the time. They sit in their car, gather themselves before they drive off. But in this case, that team was in for a surprise when the man got into his back seat with a gun before kidnapping him. Without a doubt, this crime would not be anywhere close to being solved had it not been for the remarkable clarity of this video. St. Louis Metro Police are relying on this video to lead them to this man. People are expecting police to make an arrest and they will based on what we've seen here. The video given only to News 4 shows the harrowing moments after this man in the striped shirt exits an SUV after kidnapping the driver. It does hit close to home when it's my street. Central West End neighbors say it started on the corner of Westminster Place and Lake Avenue. Police say this man was standing on the corner scoping his target before he spotted his victim. In this case, uh, a male was targeted, which is very unusual. He got into the back seat of a 17 year old's SUV, holding him at gunpoint, demanding the teen to drive him to an ATM on Kings Highway, forcing him to withdraw money. I really can't imagine what that feels like. Neighbor Heather Surrey tells me she feels confident an arrest will be made because of the cameras. I think that community is stronger when people are out and about and I'm not going to let that kind of situation keep me in my house. When the driver drops the suspect off, he's seen wiping his fingers off the SUV before walking off. It's extremely important to have these sort of cameras in place in in response to these kind of events. And this incident was all captured on camera through the Central West End Crime Fighting Network. We found there are nearly 130 cameras placed in that neighborhood. Reporting live, Ashley Lincoln, News 4.